What's going on YouTube? We have Bo Fu Lee. This is it. Ah, I don't want to get hurt. So I'll max out my defense. Check right here. Maple. She has a shield and that's all she does. She has a shield. Ah, so this particular anime. Huh. I don't know. Not too sure. So we're going to do the first uh, couple boxes. And then I'm just going to fast forward all the way to the end. Yeah, not too sure. Here's our PR card of Kasumi. The main thing on these particular cards that you're looking for is going to be the... I don't want to say it's the... Not really SP, it's the SEC. And then the Trial Deck SPs are the bigger, uh, more expensive one. If you get the Maple or the Sally, they are the probably the more expensive version of it. Uh, on the SPs, but everything else is definitely not that pricey. There is only, there's actually 12, there's 12 um, double rares, and then you do have 110 cards, I want to say. Common, 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 uncommon, and our first rare is me. She's very strong. I wish this was a little bit more serious of an anime, but it is not. So if you're looking for a light-hearted uh, VMMORPG type of uh, anime, uh, this is definitely going to be it. We have our first super rare, A Wild Adventure. Maple and Sally. Nice, nice. Uh, I will be collecting the cards. I just think that, you know, when it came down to it, I watched the entire anime. Um, it's cool. I mean, it's cool. And we got another super rare. Newbie Players. May and Yui. It's just, you know, I thought I wish it would get a little bit more serious or a little bit more intense battle. But I guess, you know, when you want to go something a little lighthearted, there's our first double rare, double rare moment between the two, Sally. It, the, it it is what it is, right? This is that's what the uh, main premise is. Maple is definitely OP in this particular one. Um, you know. I, I want to say it's okay. It's just okay. I think it's a 6 out of 10 for me. But if you want light-hearted uh, VMMO RPG protagonist, the girl is very OP. Her whole team is OP. Um, but there are stronger people. Uh, yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. But there are stronger people. Uh, Frederica. There's a rare. Uh, there are stronger people with super cool abilities. But again, Maple is OP on this one. Kind of like... Oh, we got another Sally. Kind of like, in general, like, at Akashic Record, a record. But I think in general, like, if they balance it out a little bit, because in a VMMORPG or any type of RPG or MMORPG, you know, oh, ease, you do get nerfed. It, it's just a plain nerf. If you're too OP, you get nerfed. Um, I don't think, oh, there's a certain giant killing, man, Yui. I don't think keeping Maple that OP doing everything that she was going to do is a good healthy way to keep uh an mmorpg going because you just have to follow the same defense and the same thing that she did to make stuff happen basically she eats everything she just eats and then eats more and then just keeps eating and then next thing is she's super strong kasumi and that's basically the whole anime her friend sally is stupid strong as well Two faces within me. And yeah. Uh, you know when it comes down to it. I wish everybody else had super cool abilities. Maple and Sally. Because apparently nobody else really had like. All these crazy. Like she was dope. She was just randomly like. Cool. But. Guy like him. Super speed dread. No, none of these guys had any type of like superpowers, Pain. That's the uh, you know. Akatsuki Pain. Stupid strong. I think, and look, Walking Fortress Maple. Invulnerability. When I mean, she's like that, invulnerability. Like, it, it's, uh, like I said, if it was a little bit better, I would have to say. Um, the final battle. <coughs> I think should have been a little bit more of a climactic battle there. Um, I, I don't know. I just like it a little bit more fair or... Not always the hero winning or the protagonist always super strong. You know, something like, uh, you know, One Piece. Boom. It, it is the same thing over and over in One Piece. Like, you run up. 
They get beat up, run around, they get strong, and then beat up the bad guy. There goes Maple. But at least they get beat up, you know what I mean? That's the whole thing. You gotta get beat up. Um, in this particular one, you know, Maple never dies. Maple never loses, so Sally. I think even Sally was about to lose at one point, but Maple never loses. She has like triple aces up her sleeve just because she's been playing around. So I think in, in, in a light-hearted anime type of deal, this is a 9 out of 10. Um, but in a would I watch it again type of anime, newbie players and me and Yui, um, this is like a replay value of like a 4. For me, it's like a 4 out of 10. If it's on there, it's on there. If it's not, it's not. Uh, first couple episodes I did like, and then, I don't know, it was just, for me, it was an anticlimactic type of deal. Um, I don't know, yeah, it's just, it is what it is for me. But, I will be collecting the entire cards of this one, Kanade. Um, the only card I probably will buy is going to be the S, Trial Deck SP of Maple. Oh, Battle Ready Force Yui, because... I think that's the only one that really shows Maple, so I do like that card, Guardian Angel Maple. And that's the card, Battle Craft Woman, Crafts Woman Ease, Izu. Ease, so we got five, hopefully there's six, because this is going to be pretty darn unique, um, as do have to put in play sets. And Misery, she's pretty dope, she's a healer. And then the craziest thing is like they don't have any healers, so she's just stupid strong. But without a healer. In most and probably all MMORPGs, VMMO, whatever you want to call it, any type of MMORPG, you need a healer. But she, they basically put her so strong that she doesn't need a healer. And everybody else, again, is super strong without needing a healer. So it's kind of like, oh, alright, we don't really want to be a healer. Our, this is going to be our, kind of like our promo, me. But yeah, I mean, like I said, if you want lighthearted, this is actually really good. I did mess up. I didn't buy enough of this particular set uh, because I got a lot of pings afterwards of, hey, do you have any more product? So this is a five double rare set uh, per box. So let's see how the breakdown comes along when it comes down to, you know, getting play sets here. But again, when it came, it came down to it, I, I based the sales of this to the Japanese one and I could not get rid of the Japanese one so I'm like oh battle ready force me I couldn't get rid of the Japanese one so long story short I didn't order a lot of this one which then I messed up rumored player in blue Sally which then a lot of people do want boosters child X and uh, yeah, like I said I messed up I messed up Saint misery boom And this is the other one. Loving Sacrifice Maple. She didn't use this at all. I like this actual. This, I got confused. But this particular scene when she does that is actually pretty cool. But again, overpowered. I like I like balance in my little animes, you know. I like balance. But I think the thing is a little too OP. Like, have you ever watched Isekai Smartphone? Oh, God. That thing is just horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. I will never ever watch that ever again. I was like six episodes through when I decided that this was a horrible anime, so I was already uh, invested in it. Information Warfare, Sally. But again, we got the other two Shield and Buckler, Maple and Sally. But again, uh, there's been a lot of talk about investors, and we did get our first SP beat, May and Yui. This on the JP side is a $40 card there's spa and spb so the spa will probably be her signature spb will be hers or one of the others this might be her and she might be there so we got our first sp right here boom giant killing manually jp is about 40 bucks so not too bad not too bad we could always do worse actually that might be the worst one in jp Let's see atrocity maple yeah, if you guys haven't watched it, just watch Atrocity Maple and you're like, dude, she keeps going. Like, like dude. Ah, but yeah, I think uh, the next one is going to be Kaguya, so uh, I'm going to watch that. If I like it, 
it's gonna be great. If I don't, uh, maybe not going to buy. Federica, Feder Federica. I don't know if I'm gonna collect the set. Again, that that's gonna be one of those sets that have no real cool SPs. Oh, there we go, Flame Emperor, me. May not have any type of real strong value, but I heard the enemy is strong, so there's a following for it. So I did pick up a good amount of it. Here we go with Maple again. And it's going to take forever to sort out. Guildmaster Maple. She does become the Guildmaster. And then she gets a giant flying turtle. Well, hopefully the turtle's in here too. No, I did open up a whole bunch of JP version of this. And I don't know. I already have a lot of the cards. So hopefully um, I can put it on TCG Play and people will buy it from me. Because I don't know what else to do with those cards. Machine God Maple. So this SP is probably the most expensive one. Machine God. So look at that. Atrocity Maple, Machine God, freaking Angel God, whatever the heck it she is. Every kind of God. Nobody else has that kind of transformation but her. So that's why I kind of like, it's like, man, come on. Chomping down, she just keeps eating everything. It's like, holy crap. And I do get it. Yeah, in a MMORPG, don't eat everything. Multicolored Sally. Okay, so we got almost, okay, so we're almost at all 12. So hopefully, we will have the 12 right here. Flare Axel, me? Actually, we wouldn't because, yeah, there's 12 of them. So, alright. Well, this is going to be the final boost pack before we transfer all the way to the very, very end. <sighs> Again, hit that like button, subscribe, and make a comment. I've been hearing people doing, like, booster, uh, booster pack, like, box openings. And all these different things going on. Best Friends, Maple, and Sally. DAL's up on the rise, so we gotta talk about that one coming up shortly as well. Event bonus and maple. And you're wondering like what's going on with that? There's just Snow White Maple. Alright, that's when she got new armor. Um, there's just a lot of buzz around that particular set. Still, Young Genius Kanade, which will be right there. Boom. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to switch up to the next portion, which is gonna Crack everything open and show you what I got. Alright, and we're back. So, long story short, you're barely going to get one and a half play sets in this particular set. Like, there's a lot of sixes and sevens on the double rares. Um, you can see most of them there. So, I'm going to show you guys the quick promos. Three and four promos. And these are going to be all the super rares that you get. You get a ton of them. Like, there's just a million of them. So I'm not too sure exactly what's going on here, but there's a million of them. Whole bunch of variants. Then the, we got the SPs. We got Saint Misery. Oh, that's the regular. Then we got Kasumi. And then we got the Mei and Yui. And then we got these two as well. Yeah, you only get about a place set and a half per case. So this is going to be a little bit of a tough one. Um... Ladies and gentlemen, hit that like button, subscribe, and make a comment. This one is a doozy of a set. So, but yeah, that's basically it. Alright y'all, have a good one. Take care.